Hello friends, I am your travel girl Sneha. In this video, I will provide you a complete guide to Tirupati Balaji temple visit, where I will tell you how many days tour you should plan, what will be the budget of the tour, which other local temples you can visit, how to book special entry darshan ticket, what food you can try, and full details of hotels in Tirupati. This video will be really informative, so watch till the end of this video. If you are visiting this channel for the first time, please subscribe my channel and turn on the bell icon to get notification of every new videos. You can also follow me on Facebook and Instagram. To reach Tirupati, you will get direct flight from Hyderabad, Bangalore and New Delhi. Trains are also available from all cities of India. We travelled in Bande Bharat Express from Hyderabad and returned in Narayadri Express. The journey by train was comfortable in both the trains. The train fare depends on which part of India you are coming from. You only need two days to complete this Tirupati tour. On reaching Tirupati, get into a hotel near Tirupati railway station. There are lots of hotels available, no need to book in advance. Room rent will be 1000 to 3000 for two person per night. Additionally, there is TTD Trust Rest House, Vishnu Nivasam and Sri Nivasam, for which advance booking needs to be done through TTD apps or website. We stayed in Vishnu Nivasam. Rent was 1000 for AC room and 300 for non AC. Three persons are allowed in one room. The rooms were spacious and clean. You can watch the full videos of our stay in Vishnu Nivasam. Links in the description box. On the first day, go to Padmavati Ambavadi Temple. You can reach here by sharing auto or jeep by paying Rs 50 each. It is situated only 5 km from Tirupati Railway Station. It is believed that if you are coming to Tirupati to get Darshan of Sri Venkateshwar Balaji, then first you should visit Padmavati Ambavadi Temple, where wife of Lord Balaji resides. The temple remains open from morning 5 am to evening 9 pm. In this temple, there may be rush and the darshan time may vary from 1 to 4 hours. We took special entry darshan ticket from temple counter for Rs 50 and completed our darshan within 1 hour. Don't forget to collect Laddu Prasad for your friends and family after darshan. Next visit Vakula Mata Temple. It is located 10 km away from Padmavati Temple or Tirupati Railway Station. Sharing auto or jeep will take you to this temple by paying 100 rupees per person. This temple remains open from morning 5.30 to afternoon 12 and then from 4.30 pm to 8.30 pm. Vakula Mata is the foster mother of Krishna Yashoda Devi who wished to live close to her son in later life. So in this Peruvanda hill, just akin to Tirumala Hill, the temple of Vakula Mata is situated. Here devotees rush is less, so you can get darshan here quickly. After darshan here, come back to the hotel and have lunch and take rest. In the evening, visit Venkateshwara Kalyana Temple or Old Tirupati Balaji Temple. This temple is situated 12 km away from Tirupati Railway Station. The significance of this temple is that Lord Balaji lived here for 6 months after his marriage. So newlywed couple comes here to take blessing of Lord Balaji and his wife. You can spend some time in the evening sitting at the temple premises to feel the divine aura. Next visit Tirupati Iskon Temple. This temple is very well designed and maintained. You can spend some time listening to Hare Krishna Hare Rama Kirtan and indulge yourself to divine state. Return back near to railway station from where you will find many restaurant and food stall for your dinner. We tried food at PS4 restaurant. The taste was very nice. On the next day morning, head towards Tirumala where the main temple of Tirupati Balaji is situated. You can reach Tirumala by bus or by jeep. AC bus fare is 110 and sharing jeep 120. Bus and jeep are available near railway station all day. There is free non-AC bus also available to reach Tirumala. To reach Tirumala from Tirupati, it will take around 45 minutes to 1 hour. On the way, there is Saptagri check post where all your luggage and in person will be checked. Single use plastic and tobacco and other addictive substances are not allowed to be carried to Tirumala. There are different entry points and different tickets for entering Tirupati Balaji Temple. For free darshan and SSD token darshan queue, you need to wait 12 to 15 hours. So the best way to quick darshan is by booking special entry darshan ticket online in advance. This ticket will be available at TTD apps and website. There is a limited monthly ticket quota 
So watch out for the notification of date and time of booking this ticket. This ticket gets sold within few minutes of opening. So be agile to book this special entry darshan ticket. Once this ticket is confirmed, then book your train or flight ticket and make this Tirupati tour plan. It is believed that one must visit Lord Varaha Swami temple before visiting Tirupati Balaji's temple. So do visit Varaha Swami's temple within the temple campus. Next stand in the special darshan queue with print out of the ticket and aadhar card. All the luggage and mobiles etc will be deposited at the checkpoint in the queue. These deposited luggage and mobiles can be collected after darshan from PSE4 center. Within 3 to 4 hours after standing in the queue, you will get a glimpse of the idol of Lord Tirupati Balaji. Many devotees pray by looking at the idol of Balaji situated in the temple's silver arch as very less time one gets to see and offer pray inside the temple. You can donate money, gold or other precious item in the Srivari Hundi. This donated amount a later distributed to the community at large. With every darshan ticket, you will get a laddu absolutely free from the laddu center. In addition, 4 more laddus can be collected by paying rupees 50 for each laddu. As per the Hindu ritual, you can break coconut and lit up diyas to pray to Lord Balaji at this place. There are many shops alongside the temple from where you can collect idols of Tirupati Balaji and other gift items. There is Anna Prasadam Center inside the temple where you can get free breakfast, lunch and dinner every day. At this Tirumala Hill, there are other historic and religious significant places which you must visit. There are 6 hidden gems of Tirumala which can be covered within 3 to 4 hours. You will get sharing jeep for just rupees 200 each or entire jeep for rupees 12 to 1500 to visit these 6 places. You can adjust this Tirumala sightseeing tour as per your Darshan ticket time slot. If you get morning time slot for Tirumala Balaji temple then after Darshan you can start this Tirumala sightseeing tour. And if your time slot is in the afternoon then first complete this sightseeing in the morning itself and then stand in the queue of Tirumala Balaji main temple as per your time slot. The first spot is Srivari Padalu. It is believed that Lord Balaji when descended to earth from Baikuntalok, his feet first touched this place. It is situated at the peak of Tirumala Hills. The second spot is Shila Thoranam. Here you can see the rare geological rock making a shape of an art. This shape can only be found here in entire Asia. The third spot is Chakra Tirtham. It is believed that the chakra of Lord Vishnu fell at this place and a crater is created. You will find a lake down here with natural water sources flowing into it. The fourth spot is ancient temple of Venugopal Swami. Here you can see the avatar of Krishna holding flute in his hand. The fifth spot is Akash Ganga. This is a natural waterfalls and the water is clean and pure. Till date, the water from Akash Ganga is used in every ritual in Tirupati Balaji temple. The last spot is Papa Vinasham. Here earlier waterfalls was there. Now a dam is created and water is flowed through pipe. It is believed that if you take bath in this holy water, your sins will be washed away and you can start a new beginning. After visiting these 6 places and getting darshan of Tirupati Balaji, come down to Tirupati station by sheer taxi or bus and head towards your home by train or flight. Now let's check the budget of this Tirupati tour. Hotel for 2 person 2 night 3000 rupees. Food for 2 person 2 night 1200 rupees. Special darshan ticket for 2 person 600 rupees. Auto or car or bus fare total for 2 person 2000 rupees. Total expenditure 6800 for 2 person. So only 3400 will be required to complete this entire 2 days Tirupati tour for each person. If you like this video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. Govinda Govinda